So you're looking for a Jumbie, eh? Well, you're going to need the following evidence. EMF activity, thermometer activity, and spirit box activity. And now for a bit of lore. Jumbies come from Venezuelan and Colombian folklore and have also been transported over to Caribbean folklore. Jumbies aren't a specific ghost. They're more of a classification for a cast of demonic entities. So how does a Jumbie come to be? Well, if you were a bad person in life, and I mean a pretty evil and sadistic bad person in life, you will turn into a Jumbie. Jumbies in appearance are said to be more of a mist or a fog formation. So pretty much like a shadow person. So what are Jumbies like in game? Well, they act as more like a consistent active ghost. They're actually one of the best ghosts you can find in the game because not only do they have a well-rounded and more apparent activity level, they also are the only ghost that has an all-equipment evidence requirement. So it's pretty much the ghost that you train on in order to figure out how to play the game. And ironically enough, it was the very first ghost that I ever found in Phantom Investigation. It can be hostile at times, but for the most part, it generally is just creepy for creepy's sake. It's not going to attack you for the most part, but I wouldn't count on any of these ghosts to not take their chance against you. 